Hi, this is Mike Slowinski, uh, Library Media Coordinator for the West Pier School District. And today I'm going to show you how to upload a document to your Google Docs account. So I'm right here on Google.com and I'm going to go up to the right hand corner and click on Sign In and enter my login information for my Google account. All right, once I've done that, now I'm in my personal Google account, I want to go up to the top menu to the More option. And I'm going to drag down all the way to Documents. And this is going to bring me to my personal Google Docs account. So you can see that I have you know, quite a few documents that I've uploaded before. And to upload more, you're just going to go and click on the Upload button and then click on Files. All right, so now it'll bring you, it'll let you browse from your computer any file that you want to upload. So let's say I want to upload this audio file right here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and select it and click Open. And then it's going to ask me about the upload settings. In this particular case, the upload settings don't matter. But in general, um, it, it's asking you if it wants uh, you to convert the documents, presentations, and spreadsheets you're trying to upload into Google Docs format. I would keep that selected because uh, in general that's a, a good thing. So go ahead and click Start Upload and then you can see this little bar is going and the audio file is uploading. All right. Once it is finished it's going to say Uploaded and then you'll get a message up here that says that your file has been uploaded. So once you get that message you can hit the little box here and then click Refresh in your browser and you can see here is the file I just uploaded. All right, but now the way that uh, the way that the settings are, I am the only person who can access this file at this time. So we still need to share this file with others. So if you click on the file you've uploaded, and if you end up getting this um, message here, just click on continue to the website. Okay, so now here is the Google Doc version of my uh, audio file. So I could download it if I'm on a different computer and want to listen to it. Uh, but what we're concerned with right now is uh, sharing this. So you're going to click on Share. And also, one more time, click on Share. And you can see that right now the access is private. Only people below can access it. And I'm the only person listed below. So I'm going to go to Change because I want to have anyone who has the link be allowed to uh, view or listen to this audio file. So I click that. I'm going to keep anyone allowed to edit unchecked because I want to be the only person who can edit this uh, document. And I'll click Save. And here's the link then for me to share. So I can go ahead and copy that right here if I want. And I'll close. And now uh, wherever I paste that, I could go paste it on a website. Um, I could paste it into an email and send it to somebody. Wherever I decide to go and paste that uh, URL, it will be able to be accessed by whoever you sent it to. All right, so I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, please contact me at extension 1333. All right, thank you and good luck.